guys, so I'm going to do a quick review of some proteins. I know, I know, Redcon, Redcon, but um, believe it or not, I do try other brands of stuff sometimes. And um, these happen to be my favorite cereal flavors. Um, someone had asked me to get the uh, the Twinkie and the Hostess uh, Cupcakes ones, but I haven't gotten them on sale. These were on Super Sale. Uh, they were buy one, get one 50% off, and then 20% off, and then I had a $5 coupon. So I got them just super dirt. You know I'm about saving. So when I saw that I could get them super dirt cheap, went ahead and tried them. So let me pop these things off, and we'll be right back with that. All right, so uh, I'm going to start with the Fruity Pebble one. It's got little birthday sprinkles in it. So I don't know if you can see the little birthday cake sprinkles, but all right, we'll see how it tastes. And... I use a I use a Redcon one shaker so they uh still have that brand fidelity. I think I use too much water. We'll see. All right. <clears throat> Got some there you go, Redcon one. Yeah. Oh, this is good. It tastes just like a cereal. They were on point with this. Mm -hmm. Fruity Pebbles, definitely. Definitely tastes like Fruity Pebbles. Hmm. All right, well, that was good. That was a hell of a good price I got in my seat, man. So, um, it's got a chocolate one. I need so much water this time. All right. It's a good chocolate. Yeah. I just like the, the, the milk after. It's a good chocolate. It is a good clean chocolate. Hmm. All right. So flavors on point. Um, I really, the Fruity Pebbles one really tastes like Fruity Pebbles. The chocolate is a decent tasting chocolate protein. Um, these are whey isolates, whey isolate, whey isolate. Um, so it's a good protein. It's low carb. 22 servings in the chocolate one. And 24 servings in the uh, Fruity Pebbles one. So you get more servings in the Fruity Pebbles one. Um, see, I got these... about 15 bucks each. I think they retail for like 35 or 40, 45. I don't know. I never pay retail. So <laughs> I, like I said, they were buy one, get one 50% off. And then I got 20% off of that. And then I had $5 coupon. So, um, I didn't pay much for them. Uh, yeah, it's, it, I mean, at that price, yeah, I'd go with it. Um, I'm not big on isolates to be honest with you. They tend to give me the uh, the bloating, the runs, um, but it's a good brand. Diamatize is a good brand. It's full disclosure. Um, Two point six grams of leucine. So, I mean, if you can get them on sale, go for it. Definitely taste like Fruity Pebbles, and you get 24 servings in this one. 25 grams of protein. This is only one gram carb. That's it's a decent protein. It is um, definitely a decent protein if you can get it on sale. I would not pay. Uh, I would not pay retail for anything. Uh, you guys know me. I'm all about savings. So I um, highly recommend them. They're good. They're a great isolate. I can definitely see myself taking it after a workout. Um, hit the spot. Or if you have that sweet tooth craving. Uh, they're just not thick. That's the only problem I have with isolates. And that's why I kind of stick with the MREs. The MRE is thick and it, it feels more filling. Um, whereas this, I just drank these. And I'm hungry. I'm starving. So, uh, yeah, that's that's the big thing. So post-workout, probably great, um, great idea to, to take them. Or first thing in the morning after my cardio, probably a great time to take them. But I uh, highly recommend them if you can get them on sale. 
um, by all means, uh, acquire them. But uh, it gets my thumbs up. The, the, the chocolate was a very decent chocolate, and the Fruity Pebbles definitely taste like Fruity Pebbles. Uh, the Cocoa Pebbles, not, not like, it's a good chocolate. It's not, I'm not going to, it's not Cocoa Pebbles, but it's a good chocolate. It's a really good chocolate. And I'm not big on just chocolate flavors, so that should tell you something. All right, I'm out. Hope you enjoyed the review. Um, have a great weekend, guys.